next video. I'm super excited to take you through my favorite muscle group today. We're going to train legs, which is going to be mainly glute focused because I try and focus more on the glutes, less on my quads because I'm quite quad dominant. I'll put the whole workout into the comments below. Copy and paste that and follow along if you wish. And I hope you guys will like it. So let's just get straight into it. So we're starting off with some glute activation exercises. Something that I forgot to film um, was actually my warm up, which I did 15 minutes on the stair machine. You don't have to do 15 minutes, uh, five to 10 minutes is fine, but I just like to warm up my muscles and get them prepped. This is what the activation is for as well. It's to really engage those glutes, get them all ready for a great workout. So right now I'm doing side steps and then I go, I also do kickbacks. So the glute kickbacks, I keep my band quite high to try and remove my quads because I get quite a bit of quad engagement. So I'm trying to really focus on burning my glutes as much as possible. Um, I'm using Gracefit UK bands here. They are absolutely amazing, highly recommend them. Their post takes a little bit of time to get to you, but they are so worth the investment. And straight into hack squats. So I keep my band on, really focus on pressing through your heels here and going as slowly as possible on the way down. I'm really controlled with all of my exercises. You'll probably find that in a lot of my workouts, I take everything quite slow. So really take time to engage my muscles and you'll feel a heap more burn, like your muscles will be shaking by the time you finish this. So this is a superset, starting off with regular hack squats with the resistance bands, keeping it quite light because I'm going straight into reverse hack squats. So here I'll face the other way. Make sure that you set the pads quite far back in your shoulders so that you're really supported. And push through your heels again. Really setting your bum backwards and sitting into the squat and pushing through your heels and squeezing up the top. These will absolutely kill you. Next movement is a hip thrust. I'm doing myo reps on the hip thrust machine. So myo reps are kind of a variation of basically a superset where you start off with 10 reps followed by two deep breaths and a bit of a break and then straight into five more reps, another two deep breaths and a break and then five more reps. This absolutely kills your glutes. You'll be shaking because it really pumps all the blood to the muscle group that you're trying to focus on especially if you're squeezing those glutes super tight. So you can see here I'm pushing my hips all the way through, squeezing my glutes, keeping my chin down, back straight. I really focus on trying to release my glutes at the bottom as well, so I'm getting the full contraction up the top of the movement. So you can see I slowly release and then squeeze up at the top. I use a barbell pad as well. This just really protects your hips and pubic bone if you're a chick, and I'm sure it'll help dudes as well. Um, again, I'm using my Grace Fit UK band just for extra tension and to really kind of fire up those glutes a bit more. So here I'll go into the final few reps. I'm absolutely dying at this point because it really hurts. You actually get to the point where you are shaking because your glutes are so sore. So I repeat this three to four sets. This time I did four sets. I am still limping today. <laughs> Next up, we have reverse lunges. So I'm doing these on the Smith machine as well. I've dropped the weight down because we're going to be doing eight reps on each leg, followed by pulse squats or half rep squats into full squats. So you'll see um, this will really, again, after your legs are burning from the hip thrusts, you'll be tired. And keep your front knee straight, 90 degree angle. Step back and slowly lower your back leg. Really focus again on squeezing. I bring my foot forward just to full release and then get the full contraction. Here we go straight into the pulse squats. So these are one and a half rep squats. So you go down to half a rep and then come all the way up. But that is considered one full rep. So we're going to be doing six of these, six to eight, uh, and then we're repeating the superset 
four times. Next exercise, I am doing lying hamstring curls. So with these ones, I, I do 10 reps, just regular both feet, having the pad set up about midway down your calf, really squeezing up at the top, keeping your hips pressed down into the pad, uh, and really squeezing your hamstrings all the way up to the top. I do a real slow release on the way down to keep everything engaged. And then I'm going to go into single leg hamstring curls. So I drop the weight down and I will do eight sets or reps on each leg. Finishing off with hip extensions. These are going to be drop sets to really fire up those glutes and send all the blood to the muscle group. I actually walk off this with the biggest pump ever. So I do 10 set, 10 reps, drop, drop the weight, 10 reps, drop the weight, 10 reps. The final 10 reps in this set, you'll see that I actually use my hands to assist me because this is my final set of three and I am an absolute failure. So that can actually help you if you wanna keep going, you don't wanna finish or drop the weight down anymore, but just to really pump out those final reps. workout that was a freaking awesome late day I am feeling it I literally felt like my ass was on fire when I was leaving the gym so that's always a really good sign I also was feeling really pumped up I took some pre-workout some of Tom's pre-workout which I don't normally do and I had a coffee so I was bouncing with energy so I decided to do 30 minutes on the stair master at the end um, that's just my personal preference. I also did a warm up on the Stairmaster beforehand so I didn't video that but that's what I did at the beginning so I put like a little little thing to show you that I did that um, super burner so I'll let you know how I feel in a couple of days I'll probably be really sore but if you do the workout comment below let me know how it went if you liked it tag up made along I'll put the whole workout in the description box below so you can just copy and paste that to your phone so let me know if you liked it and please remember to subscribe and to like them and hopefully I'll do some more for you soon see ya